as I stare at the haters from above my shades. <laughs>
thoughts, if you will. I know I'm probably going to get demonetized for saying the word thought or calling them thought. But as I said today, I am looking at the haters from above my glasses, above the shade. <laughs> so enraging to me that I have to sit down and listen to these guys that I've watched talk about these Twitch thoughts that is just they do nothing to entertain you nothing they're just there watching other people's stuff and if you enjoy that stuff i am not throwing shade at you guys that go there to watch this stream that's what you enjoy that's what you enjoy i am not sub to anybody on twitch that just sits down and watch stuff i'm sub to people who watch video games they may react to like game trailers and stuff like that but that's about it but i sub to people who play video games i'll I be watching dr disrespect maximilian dude people like that rogers base i'm just throwing out some names that you might know that i know i am sub to them right i support those channels because they're entertaining pokimane is not entertaining to me all she does is react to other people's stuff that's already on YouTube or whatever. Let's be honest. We we all know what the youngins are there for. We all know what they're there for. See if she's going to get up out of her chair and show you that booty. That's what they're there for. Because she got, she got a fatty back there. I'm not going to lie. She got a fatty back there. She got a fatty back there. That's what they're there for, man. I know. I don't care if they come for me. Come for me. Come for me. I am looking at you above the shades i don't care and all they want is your money that's all they want that is all they want it's only gonna be a matter of time it's only gonna be a matter of time you see the true colors will come out when you ain't got to give the true colors will come out when they're hurting you know what i'm saying the other topic i want to touch on is these only fans girls there was breaking news look it up for yourself shit i'm just talking here there is a story out there of a guy that sub to a bunch of OnlyFans accounts of these girls and then he get he gets the goods, he gets the goods and then he forwards those pictures, those videos to, to their fathers. Now, I don't know how true this story is, but if it is true, because they have responded, the girl's like, thanks for ruining my life and all of that stuff. Look up the story. And I have no qualms with a woman trying to tease your assets. I don't have problems with people who wants to do porn. As long as you're an adult and that's what you want to do. What I always tell people is that make sure you understand what the consequences of this is. Because we've seen it. We've seen the likes of Mia Khalifa go on. I think she was speaking with Larry King, if I'm not mistaken. That interview she did. It was either Larry King or Piers Morgan. I don't remember. Okay, but she did an interview where she was talking about her life as a and the regrets that she's have you know what i'm saying as i said go into everything knowing what the consequences are because don't come out saying and then, and then making it seem like industry did you wrong you went in there knowing what the shit was about you knew you were gonna get gang back you knew you were gonna get double penetrated you knew that the well those are stuff that you choose you could choose to do you could choose to do whatever kind of porn you want to do you could say i don't want to do anal you could <laughs> talking about a lot of stuff right now that's definitely going to get me demonetized i'm just trying to make an entertaining video for y'all as we look at the haters from above the shades <laughs> I am throwing shade today at all these people out here. So back to the OnlyFans argument. Would you want your daughter to be doing OnlyFans? Because they make they make boku money. You know what I'm saying? They be out here making that cash money. But you have these girls that are faking their age and doing this on OnlyFans. They're faking their age because there's no way of verifying on OnlyFans when you are signing up for only fans my simps out there you could be jacking off to a underage girl and don't even know it it's some crazy stuff going on out here in the world today i'm talking to the young woman of today that is not the only way to make 
money. And it seems like that is the avenue that a lot of these girls are taking now. The Twitch, the showing your, your cleavage on YouTube and the OnlyFans and the premium Snapchats. I seem like a nerd talking to you right now because I have all these anime logos behind me. <laughs> that is not the only option out here. I used to watch porn, so I know the names. I know the ladies in the industry, not so much the men. I see. A, I also see a lot of videos on YouTube talking about no fap. Good luck. <laughs> Good luck with convincing young men to, to no fap. And the young men that are coming up these days, like the age that they're living in and the age that we living in right now, where sex is practically everywhere, insinuated in everything that we can consume as people today. Anything can be sexualized. It's crazy. Good luck with convincing them. Oh, trust me, guys, when I tell you that it is not easy to convince a young man, late teens, early 20s, to not masturbate. Because these women out here, boy, early 20 ladies are picky. And especially with everything else that is going on that's in that's empowering them with feminism and all of this other stuff. Oh boy, it's hard out here for these young, trust me, I have nephews that are going through it right now. They are going through it. I need to let him understand that he's the prize. And I'm not saying ladies ain't the prize, but make sure if you are the prize, make, make sure that you're bringing something to the table. Don't just show up expecting a handout. It's getting to a point where I decided, man, I gotta look at these haters from above the shades. <laughs> there is a lot of people out here that are simping. These young men out here. Listen, man, back in the day, back in my days, my early days, man, you know, you really had to go out there and get what you want. Not everything was available just there. Porn wasn't necessarily at our fingertips back then. I was introduced to porn at a, I, 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 I want to say at the age of uh, somewhere around maybe 12, 13 years old was when I saw porn for the first time. It was crazy too because the first time I saw it, the first time I saw it, it was, we were watching that shit on VHS. Mind you, the t it was such an odd time when I, now I'm remembering it and it was such an odd time that I was introduced because somebody in our family just died the night before the funeral. <laughs> it was such a weird time. I don't know if my cousin was trying to ease our pain. Yo, dude, we got this video, man. I can even remember. I remember that first scene that I, that I saw. It was a black dude and a white woman, man. And yo, that dude was called Black Hammer. I don't, I don't, I don't, you, you never forget your first, right? <laughs> now that I'm thinking about it, that was such a wrong time to be watching porn, bruh. <laughs> what? That was some crazy times. As I said, I'm just chatting, guys. I'm just talking shit. And from that day throughout for like, I want to say for the next maybe i want to say for the next probably like eight to ten years man i was watching porn bruh still going to church though you know what i'm saying <laughs> i was still going to church they are so against masturbation they think it's wrong you know what i mean i was still going confession time <laughs> when i got married i stopped watching porn though i stopped watching porn for a good five years i want to say uh, that's how long i was married for you know what i'm saying i ain't gonna lie the vagina was good it was good it was it was good you know what i'm saying for those five years it was good i didn't have no need to turn to porn i don't mind as long as you give it to me often enough i ain't need to resort to that so i we were good on that so after that you know i dabbled you know, back and forth, but it, it wasn't the same. It wasn't the same. Now, you know, by that time, you know, now you have porn in HD and all of this other stuff, but there weren't any effort being put into porn anymore. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not saying that porn, you know, every now and then, but it was back then, porn, porn was a little bit more consistent. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to lie to you guys. I'm a man of culture. You know what I'm saying? Like there are benefits to, to, to not masturbating. No doubt. I encourage, you know, young guys to stop, but it's not, it's not an easy thing to tell a young guy to stop masturbating. That's just my two cents on that. You know, I don't say I'm just talking about a bunch of different stuff that doesn't make any sense as we look at the haters 
from above the shades. <laughs> it's just so many crazy things that are happening even during these quarantine times so i'm just making this entertaining videos for you guys man i talked about a lot with no conclusion all of this stuff that is going on I, i'm just looking at it and these maybe one day i'll do a live stream talking about all this stuff <laughs> i am literally sitting in my chair like what should i do next i don't feel like doing any more other reactions but i was like yo there's so many things going on let me put uh, put together a a, a a silly background with a bunch of logos with a bunch of anime on it and talk about random shit <laughs> tell me what you thought of this video i know it's not gonna make any sense for the most part i was just talking about a bunch of random stuff that i see in the news that's going on you know what i'm saying just addressing all of these these this stuff with these you know girls on twitch girls on only fans girls you know what i'm saying just women in general are just they they just live in life on with the easy button held down um and i'm not against it man get your bag i don't envy y'all at all and not everybody can just whip it out and make money <laughs> i just want to end this video here because i'm going to end the video with one last pull down and i will catch you guys later leave your comments in the comment section as we look at the haters from above the shades. <laughs>